application of linear programming uh, in solving uh, problems um, this is a situation where we can apply um, linear programming um, in solving this problem so this uh, you can read this I'm going to quickly summarize this basically they're trying to determine a breakfast menu using this list of um, breakfast items and so that it can fulfill the calorie requirement which is uh, 420 and then this fat cholesterol should be less than 20 and 30 and so on um, so I'm going to this this problem is taken from the Russell and Taylor 10th edition problem number 24 so I'm going to um, we're going to use the Microsoft Excel solver function in solving this so I have copied the data already um, so to start with we'll have to set the problem in a way or clean the data in a way so we can use that solver function in Microsoft Excel so um, let's say that um, we're going to see the number of serving for um, each of these items uh, we're going to determine that that how much will have to serve to minimize the cost so um, as usual Excel is start with zeros and then um, fill this um, with the optimum number and then the um, total value per breakfast So basically, we can use um, so a sum product function. Basically, if it is a say brand cereal, which is 90 calorie per serving, so let's say it uses one brand cereal. Uh, this number is replaced by one after this formulation um, calculation. So then it is going to multiply this times this plus this times this and it will keep going like this now instead of that we can simply do some product there is a function here that will do that all this manual operation for us automatically so all of these will be multi oops so this comma and all of this will be multiplied by the serving size and then give us the total so that will be our total calorie I'm going to use them for fat, cholesterol, iron, and everything. So I'll freeze this cell so that I can copy it to the next. Pressing dollar sign before and after. And then we can copy this all the way to the den up to the fiber level. Now the total, also I think we can copy all the way up to here. So that's the total cost basically. If you double click this, you can see that it's multiply this 0.8 times whatever the serving is, we'll find out soon using the solver function. So basically we're going to optimize this cost, minimize this cost. So here is the, you have to be in data tab to see the solver function um, here. So clicking the solver, um, we're going to minimize this cost. Uh, default max is selected so you have to select minimize and then it's going to change these variables to something that is meaningful or minimize the cost and then let's add the constraint so the first constraint it says that they have to have at least uh, 420 calories so that should be the total calories should be more than 420 so i'm going to select that cell add and then the next they says they cannot have more than 20 grams fat more than 30 grams cholesterol so that should be less than um, 30 and 20 20 and 30 respectively and then this um, iron calcium fiber um, this should be more than these values these values so we're done with all constraints so if you solve hit okay it will solve the um, problem basically per breakfast cost about 51 cents without linear programming this it probably took forever an excel solver function to solve this problem